hello everyone thank you and coming for watching this video today i am going to show you how to use google analytics and google tag manager to see your website results and all the audience factor and conversion rate first of all for that purpose i have to log into my google analytics account first step is to log into your google analytics account simply type the google analytics and log into okay i uh, uh, i already have uh, analytics account so if you don't have you just click on set up for free and then you will show uh, show the window like this okay here is the window that is popped up so you have to click on admin section okay Once you uh, you have clicked on admin section, this type of thing uh, occur to you and the window like this. You have to create a new account for that purpose. You can uh, name your account like uh, I can say that them name. Okay. Click on next. Then you have, have to select um, Google property name. You can select uh, your website name for this purpose. Select your time according USA. This is the standard time USA. No changes. Then currency you can also select the currency. Then you have to select the here. Here you have to select the show advanced option. Okay. Once you uh, for this is an update from Google in 2021 and 2020 to get your tracking ID, you have to check it. Okay. Here you have to paste your uh, website URL. I have my website URL this one. I will copy that and paste it. This is already an um, HTTPS, so I erase the other one and select this. Okay, that's really easy. You can create both a Google Analytics for a universal property and create a universal, uh, universal property only. You can select anyone for this purpose. I will select create a universal analytics property only click on next okay then click uh, your business type here my business type is real estate okay i will select real estate then your business size up to you okay so my business is small 1 to 10 and how do you then to use google analytics with your business check that out so i will measure the lead generation Customer engagement or uh, increase market area. You can check check all uh, uh, if possible. Okay, okay. Click on create. Here yeah. you have to click on I accept. Okay. You have to check these two one and click on I accept. Now you got your tracking ID. Dismiss this. Page is loading and we we have got our tracking uh, tracking ID. And this is the code we have uh, got from this tracking ID. Just copy this code. paste into your analytics section if you have a uh, wordpress you have to just click on your 
main website and go to header section if you have php then you have to select that code and paste in to header section different forum has different techniques so uh, the idea is to copy that code and paste into a uh, header section for the analytics section okay just i pasted that google tag update this one okay this has been updated so in order to check either this is added to your website or not we will uh, see uh, our website and refresh the website We will uh, just right click on the website and inspect the code or uh, we can just simply control shift and I press to uh, shortcut key. So uh, you uh, control control plus U, you can just use this one as well. This is the header section. Okay. Here is the post uh, Facebook pixel code. I already get it. Okay, and uh, this is the scripted. This one. This one is Google Analytics code. I just copied and pasted. You can check from here as well. Google tag site. This one. Sorry. This one, this one is the section. You just go to so this is the tracking ID. You must uh, have this tracking ID to fetch your and see uh, see all the details of uh, your website. 